No, 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 no. Why? Why didn't it work? The device should have worked. Why didn't... Oh, well, hello there. Now, who might you be? Oh, that's a very interesting name. Well, it's nice to meet you anyway. My name is, well, just so happens to be Paper Shaw. And how I do love paper. Uh, oh. You... you you don't look quite the same as I do, is there something going on with you? That's what it is. Multiversal travel. Shoulda knew it, shoulda knew it. That explains a lot anyway. Well, what is it that you were... Uh... Wait, I, I'm not surprised that you're from a different multiverse. Well, obviously not. We did that many many years ago I mean well obviously we only sent paper to a different multiverse so I think that was a pretty good step for us so uh, what is it that you uh, want from me today oh you're on a mission are you oh okay now what might that mission be oh you're on a sound mission. Well, sounds rather interesting. Excuse the pun. Uh, how can I be of service today? I was just on my way to uh, drop off these papers, but uh, seeing as you are a physical person that has gone into this multiverse, it seems that sending papers really doesn't matter anymore. So, what can I do for you today? You want me to make some sounds with this paper I have? Well, I can do that. Uh, how about we just start with one sheet? Just pop the rest down one second. So, is there uh, any type of sound you want me to make, or is it just a... Uh, Free for all. Free for all. Just though I like it. Right, let's begin with a bit of crumpling. I think that's always a good start. what you wanted. It is excellent. Well, for a first time multiversal traveller in our universe wanting to record sounds may seem a little weird, but it's quite interesting. These are the best paper sounds you will ever hear, by the way. Being in a world made of paper, you make some pretty good paper sounds. However, being in a paper world made of paper does come with its disadvantages. For example, rain. That's a big problem around here.
I mean, luckily, the sky is made of paper, the uh, clouds are made of paper, and we get paper rain. So, actually, it's not anything to worry about. Maybe paper water, but that's also paper. Oh, maybe nothing to worry about, after all. You're not carrying any water from that multiverse, though, here, are you? Don't want to bring anything. You know, a couple of drops of water around here. All turn to mush. We do not want that. Well, I believe that paper's spent, so we should move on to the next piece of paper. And I believe a bit of ripping might be a good idea. Yes, I did say earlier I was delivering all these bits of paper. We use a strange font in this universe that only paper folk can see. It might be invisible to the untrained eye, but these were very important documents. But it doesn't matter because your arrival disregards everything. Without further ado, let's hear some sounds. Sometimes the paper even sticks to you here. It's a nightmare, I tell you. Do you know what the fastest mode of transport around here is? Don't know why I'm asking you. You've been here for all of two minutes. But I'll tell you. Fastest mode of transport around here is obviously the paper aeroplane so maybe we should just use one of these bits of paper and uh, fold us up some transport I'll make a very simple paper plane for just today's experiment you need for this is some very nice sharp edges to cut through that paper air usually I would make this at a desk but since you have caught me here well 
a desk is not possible, obviously. So we need to make these triangles just like that. Bolt them at 45. I hear in some universes that's quite hard to do. But here it's quite simple. Right, next we need to fold the corners in. Just like that, perfect. And the same again on the other side. Perfect. Now don't ask me what angle that is, because I have no goddamn clue. Right. Anyway. On to the next step. Just refold it in half. You know, it's funny. My uh, my father was a paper plane maker. Made the best paper planes. He even invented the Concorde paper plane. Yeah, sadly, that had to go out of business because it was just too quick. I wonder if there was ever a Concord in any other multiverse. Would be interesting to know, and, well, if it was made of paper as well. Anyway, we're almost done here. Just a couple more folds, something like that. The other one, like that, perfect. And you know, you see that point right there? That is for cutting through this paper sky. Keep your eyes closed, obviously. Don't want to get hit. And there we go, we have our flying device complete. So with this device here, we can cut through the air, we can cut through the skies, and if you throw it really fast, we can even cut through paper. But anyway, it's time to wish our paper plane farewell on his journey, so we will uh, let it go. Look at that. Could even be off to a different multiverse. Anyway, that doesn't matter. Right. You want a couple more sounds? Well, how about we do a another crumpling and another ripping. I think you might enjoy them as well. Right. Look at this fresh, beautiful piece of paper. It's flawless in design. But in the order of science, we must destroy to create.
search a fantastic sound. However, that is enough of that. We must move on to our final piece of paper. And I believe in perfect fashion. We should just rip it away. Simply just a couple more to go. And there we go. That was that. Right, well, I should uh, probably be making a move because someone, well, was expecting some important documents, but, well, all in the name of science, I say. Anyway, I must, uh, I must leave you now, uh, that, um, ah, I know what I could do, uh, you seem like a nice chap if you, were uh, ever happen to see me again, or, well, you know, this is probably quite an important piece of paper, so I'm just going to leave you with this segment here, and, uh, hope that you can take it on your journeys to different multiverses and show people what this paper dimension can do. Anyway, here you go. And it was an honor meeting you. But now I must dash off, so see you. See you soon. Maybe. I don't know. Goodbye.